hello there, YouTube. Welcome to another 50 degree morning. It's 56 out here now. But uh, look at the how the fog is hiding the mountains back there. Absolutely love it when it does that. <laughs> Simply wonderful. Can't find, we always, Kelly gives the dogs all little treats, can't find Abby. But I watched her go in this bush over there. She just did a disappearing act, goofy mutt. She don't run far. They don't go to the high, they're old enough. Nobody goes towards the highway. The ones that are tied up, that's the ones that run to the highway. <laughs> Why do dogs go? Probably because there's just more smells out there, huh? But you got all these, probably millions of acres out here. And you go towards the highway. Just a thing, I guess, with dogs. But anyway, I think it's very beautiful. I love this kind of foggy look in the mornings. But I think it's supposed to be another close to 90 degree day again today. So let's uh, let's go bust it out. 73 degrees. In. Not a cloud in the sky here in Banchulo, mama. It's going to be warm. Yep. Yeah. Today's probably the hottest day of the week, right? Or is that tomorrow? Today and tomorrow is supposed to be 92, 93, uh, something like that. Yeah, that's, that's properly warm. Mm -hmm. Don't give you that, like, oh my lord, am I going to survive I this know, kind I'm of a thing. But, die, but it makes you go, dang, it's hot. Yeah, <laughs> it will do that. It'll cook you. Mm -hmm. Well, Mom? It's a hub. Oh, it's hump day. It is. Yeah, we made it Halfway. to the bulge. <laughs> <laughs> Well, have yourself a wonderful Wednesday, and I'll see you as day goes on, Mama. Sounds like a plan. Or, well, you see you bye. I love you. <laughs> bye bye now. Bye. So look, it's Flashback Tuesday on Wednesday. So they set these things up identical. The only thing, I get mean, a different color key, and I think the little wrap around there is a different color. I'm sure they got other things that, I'm sure they know their spiders apart. But one thing I noticed while I'm pulling this cover off, look, same thing. You should never see that gap. And that thing just, like I was showing you yesterday, and I'm sure this is the same way, I can't see it from here, but the outer edge of that thing just rides on this upper cowling piece and just wears the paint right off of it. Just sits there and vibrates and wears it off. So I don't know, I don't know why that's such a thing at times, but. It is, but there we are, zero dust. Man, the right side's hanging off so far, it almost looks like it's about ready to fall out of there. Boy, if you don't get that latch turned enough, you're gonna be buying them covers. It's such a, I don't know. I don't just think people just don't pay attention. I don't think they're doing it because they can't figure it out, it's just, I don't think they realize that it's not attached unless you hook them things underneath there. It's kind of weird to put them on. You got to fiddle with them a little bit. But when you see that there's a right way and a wrong way, you uh, you kind of go forward from there. But good thing is they're both on, on the bike. They haven't flown off. You know, we'll fix them right quick. Who's to say what's going to happen in the future? <laughs> All righty. So I just met a really nice couple and uh, the gentleman just bought a um, iron 883 from us, but somebody had gutted out the stock exhaust and it's just way too loud for him. So he's been following the, the deal with this Sportster and um, he decided he wants this. And I mistakenly said rear O2 sensor, it was a front O2 sensor that was going bad. So we're trying to get an O2 sensor. I, I don't know what the ETA is from the Harley shop or if they have one or we may end up taking one off of something else. I don't know, but really cool. Guy that follows the vlog has uh, had his eye on this Iron 88 or Iron 1200. And um, I think he's gonna take this thing away from us. So that's kind of cool to meet a fan that comes in, and buys a motorcycle from us. How cool is that? And that thing's so nice. And he's a huge leave it stock, let it live forever fan. Guy after my own heart. That's pretty cool though, huh? Time to roll out of here. I'm just gathering my stuff and gonna get. Made it home safe and sound. 
uh, transferring files to my storage drive. I don't know why I just had this weird little feeling. I did a first service on uh, one of that blue BRP demo bike or a uh, RT standard. The one that, uh, that was a six degrees to the right. You remember it's sister red one was six degrees to the left. Did the steering stem and all that stuff. Anyway, I did the first service on it and a uh, nice little ride. It was wonderful, it was fun. I think spunky for some reason. I joke around saying that the demo bikes must have something special done to them. <laughs> the, the red one didn't run as good as the blue. Anyway, you just run across those. I just had this weird feeling, so I threw those things into this viewer. No audio. Well, I have audio, but just like the other day, you just hear the GoPro. Man, oh, my mic adapter thing isn't. Every once in a while, you got to get another one of those adapters. But anyway, so that's a wash. So what I thought I'd do is uh, show you the the tail of the tail of two minis. How am I gonna do this? That light's kind of funky in it. So I've been carrying the mini three around here, you know, last couple three days or whatever, and I'm going. Last night I'm going. I thought this thing had a handle on it. Cause swore, cause I know my Air 2S does. And I thought, okay, well, it's just Air 2S. Nope. The Mini 2 has a handle on it. That irritates the heck out of me. I route these things in a weird way so that they kind of become a handle. But uh, let me unzip this right quick. I was trying to drag both zippers at the same time. I'm like, why won't this thing open? Oh, it's probably because of the control here. It's going to be a definite weight difference. That is a, what do you call them, a ball face hornet or whatever? You don't want to mess with them things. They're, they're pretty docile. You just don't want to get them all pissed off. So here's the Mini 2, which you guys have seen plenty of times, I think. I don't know. That's my little flasher light thing. So with that Flymore kit, DJI included this the little propeller holder thing here so you it keeps the the blades all in a nice nice safe order very nice thing thank you dji so the mini 3 is actually less expensive than the mini 2 but uh with the mini 2 it does not with the fly more kit it does not come with that so i very quickly found one on Amazon, the Skyreet, Skyreet, which the brand's been around for a while, so that's cool. And it does the same thing. And you'll see that the uh, that the three is ever so slightly larger than the two, not by much. Look at the size difference. And the blades, that's uh, substantially larger. No wonder this thing handles so much different. And that's probably why this one has a higher pitch sound to it. So uh, let me un unfold both of them here and uh, we'll, we'll show you a little more up close stuff here. Let's get stuff out of the way here. These cases are great, they're durable. They're got waterproof zippers. I don't know how waterproof the case is, but I've gotten them soaking wet and nothing got in. So anyway, let me open them up here right quick. All right. So drastically different camera on the, uh, the Mini 3. This is kind of standard gimbal type affair. And um, they did something really odd with the 3. You see the gimbal kind of floats in the front and you see this weird I'm trying to find a place where it'll sit there so you got the roof on the top of this this thing only has like a 30 degree upward swing where you can rotate it above horizontal this one has is it 60 or more you can go almost straight up and down with this thing so you can like fly up to something and look up at it and another unique thing about this one is you can do portrait mode. The gimbal turns sideways. You can do portrait mode 
for like social media things, you know, TikTok and those things, reels and all the shorts and all those things that are in that portrait mode, you know, like the shape of your phone. I've never been a fan of videos that way, but I don't know. You watch enough TikTok and stuff, you don't even think about it anymore. Um, I just got spoiled by this thing because there's a very distinct order how you how you open these things. This one, it doesn't matter because the front and rear, the way they interlace with each other, you can only do one side at a time. This one doesn't matter what you do. But this is a uh, one over one third inch sensor. Um, think of a one inch sensor and like taking a Sharpie or something and drawing a line on the inside of the one inch sensor. That's what this is. And this one, uh, the Mini 2 is considerably smaller. This is like GoPro size sensor in it. Um, yeah, I don't even remember the, the spec of it. Um, oh, the power button being on the bottom of this thing. Um, little weird. I mean, you get used to it. It's no big deal. But back to having the power button on the top. This one, you can do tracking. Like you select a subject, you on your motorcycle, and you take off and it follows you. Um, so this one has all that. The Air 2S has that stuff too. Um, sensors, it's got downward facing um, avoidance sensors, forward facing, and the rear facing ones are unique. They're in the back. And you may go, well, how does that see backwards? Well, the drone actually kind of flies in a manner similar to this. So those uh, those sensors do see back. This one has forward uh, facing sensors only. It's got, these are sensors, but they're more for like landing and stuff. So the only sensors you have on the uh, um, Mini 2 is the front facing sensors. That's it. So you're you're flying this pure purely man, manually, but both of them fly really good. This one is like flying a much larger drone, but as you can see, when it's all together and in the bag, they're essentially the same size. And oddly enough, this one does not have a fan in it. They did not put a fan in it, trying to keep under keep that 249 gram weight that. Uh, a lot less rules have to be abided by with this one. You don't have to register or anything like that. But, uh, yeah, I mean, as far as, you know, where you can fly, all, all of the things that apply, you just don't have to register the thing. And there's some other things, something to do with that under the, under 250 grams. Um, this one is also 249, so it's the same thing. But with the extra power the motors are bigger and everything else um they went away with the fan in the front face of it you can see it's got like an air duct almost a ram here where it shoves the air inside there this one actually has a fan that runs and uh you know like you're doing updates and it's sitting there you'll hear we hear it running the fan this one nothing so i did all the updates on it i just kind of directed a fan at it so it kept itself cool um yeah, I don't have any filters for this. This one kind of has one of those clip-on. You can see kind of snaps over the over the top. And um, it's a little, little, a little weird to put on. It, it scares me I'm going to hurt the camera or the gimbal or something as I'm doing it. This one has a, like a, kind of like the GoPro's, like a quarter turn type thing or less. And it pops off messing around with this one definitely need filters um i have a polarizer filter on uh on this one it's those from freewell yeah really cool stuff tons of fun crazy fun this thing is absolutely amazing it just it flies like a full-size drone you know my my air 2s not that that's a full-size drone but it's just a really stable flyer and uh, this one, it does really good. I, I can't complain too much. But, um, you know, this one, the difference. You know you're flying a really small drone here. This one, you have no idea it's even going on. 
um, with uh, oh, they both have their three pack thing that's part of the buy more kit this one uses the uh, remote that you have to hook up a phone to you click your phone in here it comes with the cords and everything you need really is the easiest one the phone's on the top it's real easy and this one i bought it with the uh with the rc so it has the built-in screen so i don't have to mess with the phone that weird color is a screen protector i put on there the other day when i got it but super cool super fun phenomenal camera this one does really good for its size and stuff but this one is more like the Air 2S. Like I said, some of the like photo samples and stuff I've seen, but you know, who's editing them? I, I don't know. I'll play around with it myself. What I've seen so far picture-wise, this thing is amazing. But I think my Air 2S is definitely better pictures, even though I've seen samples that made it look like this was actually outperforming it. I have not seen that yet. So take some playing here. I got lanyards for both of them. The lanyard for this kind of clicks in the housing. This one, it just, you know, quick connect buckles there. But heck yeah, tons of fun. So, no ride. We'll talk about our drones. <laughs> Alrighty. Well, hello there, you two. That's called catching the light at the last moment. I think it might actually be sunset. Wasn't yeah. expecting to have to divert the vlog at the end. Something I wanted to save for another time and didn't know I was going to do it tonight. <laughs> Especially I go, oh man, look at the time. I need to get out there. As you guys seen, the light changed very quickly as I was sitting out there. But it does that. But anyway, can't cry over spilt milk. Already done. Yep, done. Next. <laughs> not next problem though. Yeah, let's not do next, next video. problem. All right. So I guess we're going to roll out on that. Alrighty. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. We really do appreciate it. We will talk to you tomorrow. Same smoke time, same smoke channel. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And you guys have an amazing Thursday or Friday. Heck yeah. Thursday tomorrow. Getting yep. towards the end of the week quick. It is. Alrighty. See you then. See you in the morning. Appreciate you watching. Yes. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.